Molesworth Station, 75 miles south of Blenheim in the Arbutary Valley, is today being run the modern way. For the spring roundup, a plane is being used, and Bill Chisholm, the station manager, changes his spurs for a flying helmet. He's going up to look for mobs of cattle that have hidden themselves in the steep gorges and rugged ranges of Molesworth's 240,000 acres, the biggest station in New Zealand. This is some of the most inaccessible country in the Dominion, part of a station that is being nursed back into production. Eighty years of traditional high country sheep farming, heavy stocking and frequent burning left the land open for erosion to do its worst. With the soil gone from the steep faces, tenants were forced to leave it to waste, ravaged by rabbits and deer. Today, the cattle being run here can be spotted from the air. Here's a message for the musterers. Cattle spotting by plane has saved them days of hard riding and fruitless searching. Now they know exactly where to find their cattle. The spring roundup is underway. In 1938, the Lands and Survey Department took over this station. It was a run mauled by erosion, exhausted. The chief aim of the department was to regenerate the land. They gave it three years rest with no grazing and the first organized effort was made to control rabbits and deer. Today, the land is slowly coming back. Young trees are starting to grow on eroded slopes and good fences are being put up so that grazing areas can be rested. Out in the valleys, straggling mobs of cattle are being rounded up, some of the herd that was started here in 1941. The biggest pest on Molesworth is rabbits. Since 1938, 190,000 have been destroyed in a steady campaign that keeps the rabbiters working all the year round. The cost of this and other work is met by the sale of surplus cattle. And this year, it looks as if there'll be plenty to sell. These are just some of the herd that must be brought in, drafted, tarried and branded. Work that makes this the busiest time of the year on Molesworth. This is hot, dirty, dusty work. The tea room for the men of this government department is out in the open, but the tea is just as welcome. Time for a smoke before going back to the branding. Branding can be easy work, but that depends on the temper of the black poll yearlings. Some of them aren't so keen to wear the TI brand. When they cut up rough or get passed over, it's up to the boys to get in amongst them. But they don't have to get underneath them. If you want all the thrills of the Wild West, you've got them right here on Molesworth. It's the real thing with no chance of anyone singing about that home on the range. With drafting and branding over, the tallies are totted up. 700 newcomers have been found in the muster. Molesworth is carrying 2,800 cattle, 
And now, as night falls, the spring roundup is half over. Tomorrow, we'll see the start of the drive to spring pastures. The dogs, eager to get started, greet the dawn. The men are up early. The dogs must be fed, horses made ready, provisions packed. There's a 26-mile drive down to Tarndale ahead. And taking a thousand cattle along with you is not the easiest way to make it. The spring drive is one of the toughest jobs on Molesworth, but it must be done so that the pastures nearer the homestead where the cattle have been wintered can be rested. The long trail winds across the Acheron River and on towards the mountains. In the spring pastures, the cattle will fatten. Some will be sold to return servicemen for rehabilitation farms. The slow climb and crossing over the Saxton Pass is the longest part of the journey. It takes them up to pastures that are 3,600 feet above sea level, 600 feet higher than the country around Molesworth Homestead. Almost there. Part of the 10-year development plan for Marlborough is the restoration of this land to its natural state. Once, Molesworth was one of the biggest sheep runs in the Dominion. Today, it's a cattle ranch that is starting to pay its way. For horse and dog, cattle and man, it's been a tough journey, but the cattle have reached their new pastures safely. The roundup on Molesworth is over. <laughs>